Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts, and today, guys, we have a pretty interesting video to react to. So I was at work today, and I got a huge long message from this guy on my Facebook page saying he wanted me to react to his Batman fan-made film. And I thought, well, usually when I get requests, it's a request to watch a video, but this is a request to watch his own stuff, something he created. And I thought, well, it's Batman-related. I'm definitely interested, so I wanted to check it out. So I click on the link, and it's actually a trailer for the fan-made film. I thought it was going to be the film. It's actually the trailer. So I'm definitely intrigued to see the full film but we have a trailer here he linked me to so i'm going to watch this give my honest opinion i told him to be honest with him but uh since he requested this i definitely want to check it out so without further ado let's get into now batman the shattered cow trailer one fan film let's get into it and see what it offers Okay. I guess that's Alfred. Ooh, there he is. Batman. Is that the penguin? We be a permanent place of work. And not beyond some bloody bookshelf in the lost wing of your manor. All it takes. One lead. Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right. Rule number one facing Batman. Oh, there he is. Never have a gun. Ooh. I like that shot. I'm thinking that's the penguin. I'm thinking. I like the title. One six. Hmm. Why does it say one six? Let's see. June first. Okay. So it comes out June first. Let me read the synopsis real fast, and then I'll give my thoughts about what I just saw. Because I want, because I want y'all to understand what's happening. Because you know, I, I'm pretty confused as well. Batman has been putting low-level enforcers in Arkham, low-level offenders who work for the Penguin and Maxi Zeus. After months of planning, the two decide to collaborate to take the Batman down. However, they both recognize the fact that they cannot do it for the do it themselves. So after months of the lost profits they have endured, they decide to hire Prometheus, who is an assassin that is a polar opposite compared to Batman. He shares similar skills to the Cape Crusader. However, the key difference is Prometheus will kill to survive and thrive. Okay, uh, pretty interesting um, synopsis, and uh, I, I like the story. Um, number one, obviously, I mean, the guy was telling me how this was his first attempt at a uh, trailer, not trailer, a fan-made film. Uh, overall, uh, I like the trailer. Um, you can tell that it's obviously fan-made, but that, that's not really a gripe because obviously fan-made films, it's obvious. Um... The, the, that one shot with the sunglasses or whatever, and you can see Batman about to come in and punch him. That was a cool shot. Um, the guy with the beard and bald head, is that supposed to be Alfred? Because um, that definitely does not look like Alfred. I mean, if that's a different ver if that's your version of Alfred, that'd be cool. But I wish in this trailer you would have said Alfred or you, if it is Alfred, I don't know. I'm assuming it is because it's talking to a guy that looks like Bruce Wayne um, that Bruce should have said, Alfred, I can't do this or something. And there was no mention of that character's name. So I'm quite confused. So I'm sticking with, this is your version of Alfred, which is different than most iterations of Alfred. So there's that. Um, yeah, I mean, I couldn't really tell who these characters were. There was no mention of them. And like you saw this character saying, what's a burn Gotham city. I mean, I'm guessing that's the Zeus guy, and uh, I'm guessing the guy that kind of looks like the guy who plays on uh, Gotham as the Penguin, the tall guy with the pointy nose, I'm assuming that's your uh, version of the Penguin, kind of similar to Gotham, I'm assuming, because I didn't see a short guy, I saw a tall dude, so I'm guessing that's Penguin, um, but you know, for me, I, I like the look of it, I'm definitely intrigued by what the actual film is going to be. But I felt like this trailer could have been a lot better. I felt like that it could have been, I don't know, handled a little bit better in the sense of not what you've shown, but 
just giving some context of who these characters are, because all I'm hearing is some random dude saying, I want to burn down Gotham City. Uh, you linked me in this video. I could have watched the other ones too, but you linked me this specific one. Um, and so reading the synopsis, okay, the Penguin and this Zeus guy is going to go after Batman. They're going to hire Prometheus. But who is who? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> There's no mention. I know Batman's Batman because he has the bat symbol on his chest, and you see the cowl on but other than that, I don't know what's happening. I mean, I don't know. So if I could get some more insight with a second trailer, maybe I'll be able to understand what's happening here. But um, in order for me to understand more of this trailer, I had to read the synopsis. So I guess that's not really a good sign, but I can't really fault him because, I mean, it's his first attempt at making a fan-made film. Now, I'm not saying the film's going to suck. I'm just saying for the trailer, I'm just watching a bunch of guys talk about Gotham City and there's Batman punching some people and there's some cool shots but uh and then there's a guy with a beard talking to bruce i'm assuming it's bruce wayne i mean that's what my assumption and th th that's it i i don't know <laughs> i don't know what's happening so overall it's a decent trailer could have been a lot better some you know names of the characters you know one character saying to another uh, something to give me more insight to what's happening here um so that's really it. I mean, I really have no more thoughts. I mean, it's, it's, you know, I, <laughs> I told you I'd be honest. I mean, it just, the trailer could have been a lot better. I, I'm not saying it's a horrible, horrible trailer. There's just a couple of things that could have been done better for me as a viewer of the trailer to understand more about what this film will be. So there's that. So there you have it, guys. That's my thoughts, my opinions. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought about this video. I will be linking this video, of course, in the description that's at the very top if you guys want to go check it out for yourselves and all that kind of stuff. But I'm definitely intrigued. I will definitely come back and watch a second trailer uh, if you put one out. And I will definitely be intrigued to check out the full film when it gets released. So there you have it, guys. That's my video. Peace out.